friends, it's Marcy and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the start of another vlog. It is currently Monday, so we're starting on the first of the week. Well, let me know in the comments, is Sunday the beginning of the week to you or is Monday? Because for me, it's Monday, I don't know why. But I am off today, clearly, I am home, thank goodness. I worked all weekend and it was excruciatingly hot. But today, the weather has cooled and I am off, it's sunny, it's bright, I am living my best life. I just got done filming a video that should be up before this vlog goes up, hence why I'm wearing the same outfit. I am getting ready because I am going to meet Osbin when he gets off of work, which is very soon. And I want to take pictures, but I only have one idea for pictures right now. And I'm torn between two different ways that I want to do it. I texted him and I asked him his opinion, but alas, he is working. So uh, he can't respond to me in five seconds. So I'm just waiting for his response so then I can get changed and figure out what we're doing today. I am off tomorrow as well and so is he oh he might have just responded he voted for today because what I was going to say before his text message interrupted our lovely conversation is that he's off tomorrow as well as I so depending which way we take this photo I might be taking it tomorrow I might be taking it today but based off of what he just said he thinks today so I have to change my outfit but we've been productive y'all I filmed a video I finished editing a vlog that should be going up tomorrow so that will already be up when this is up I posted on Instagram I have a TikTok going up today I've been reading and right now I am reading red white and royal blue by Casey McQuiston let's acknowledge my cute bookmark a little bumblebee relakuma. I figured since I have you guys here, sorry if you see me looking to the side, my phone is charging right behind the camera. We will open this mystery box. I know in my last vlog, I purchased this and then I said I was thinking of doing a TikTok. I'm not gonna film a TikTok for it anymore. So let's open it now because I have had this for like over a week sitting on my desk, which I mean, the whole box is very my room, so it doesn't even matter. But I want to know which one I get. In case you missed the last episode of Princess Diaries, aka my vlogs, I picked this up at Miniso for like $15. It was stupid expensive. It's literally advertised as a bag charm and y'all know I love a good bag charm. These are all the different princesses that you can get in their slumber party attire let's see who we get okay i switched the angle so that this can be a whole little moment in the vlog but here we go i'm kind of sad because i really really think this box is so pretty i might have to like let me give you guys a little backstory. So I bought a Miniso mystery princess bag charm in the past. Not this one. It was a different one. And I got Snow White. I don't know where I put it. So I can't show you guys right now. Maybe later in the vlog I'll find it and I'll be able to share. But Miniso mystery boxes come with a little card inside of whatever it is that you got. So it's like a spoiler card essentially. So I'm going to try to avoid looking at that. I already see the card but okay we didn't see the card this is the bag they're pretty big all right you guys see first <gasps> we got jasmine oh no i'm obsessed look at how adorable she is she's got her pillow she looks like she's like kneeling like on a magic carpet she's so cute i don't even have to use this as a bag charm i can just display this on my shelf somewhere in my room are you kidding me these are so cute let's look at the little spoiler card it's a little jasmine on the card and the card just kind of looks exactly like the box okay if we are near this miniso today i might have to splurge and get another one i really want cinderella i really want ariel and i really want aurora there's no way to tell which one you'll get because you can't really feel them they're in a box and then they're in this oh, i shouldn't have done this to myself Ah, oh, why must i fall prey to cute mystery things yet again all right friends i thought i'd give you guys 
a fit check before I head out. So I changed into this pink dress. I got this from Hot Topic. I put my hair in a claw clip. It's not gonna stay in the clip for the picture, but this is just my going out outfit. I have on my very dirty white Vans with some frilly socks that are probably too long for this fit but it's fine it kind of gives it a sporty look the frilly socks are from forever 21 my headband this pearly one i actually just bought recently from the disney store and it's available on shop disney i changed my earrings because it was a little bit too much castles going on so i put on these bow ones these are sugar fix from target and my necklace is rebecca hook x disney i figured out how i'm going to take the pictures so i'm just packing my tote bag now i am going to take these kind of scuffed up and dirty small heels these are also from hot topic and i'm going to change into them for the picture the outfit doesn't really matter because it's all about this bag. This is the like pink, perfectly pink princess, literally what it's called, lounge fly bag that was a pink a la mode exclusive. I pre-ordered this in February of last year and I received it in like March of this year. So it took forever, but I just wanna take some cute pictures with this. I actually just took it out of the plastic right now and rose gold hardware has my entire heart, but look at the zippers. They're literally little crowns, so cute. So this is the bag that I am shooting and this is the outfit. Get in boba before we go take pictures. I have an Osmo. Osmo, show the people your tattoo. <laughs> he got a new he got a new tattoo. Ooh, ah. Got boba. Well I got boba. He got a slushie. We're walking through Central Park. We're looking at all the cute dogs and we're gonna take some pictures before it gets cloudy and dark. This is really good. This is where I'm hoping to get some good pictures. Yeah, as I'm saying, maybe somewhere here. I'm gonna try and do one by the fountain. Here's my ace photographer. He always gets the vision. Very princess-esque. I do have to change my shoes. I did bring my little pink Hot Topic heels. Basically giving you as a Central Park tour. And then over here somewhere would be cute. Also, this is like my favorite area of Central Park, aside from the Alice in Wonderland statue. came back to Miniso as I expected that we would and they actually have new princess mystery things which is you know terrible for my wallet but this is some of them so these are the rest of the princess ones the PJ party one that's the one I have this jasmine with the little like cake box is a jewelry box and then they have these really cute princess in like traditional Asian wear I, I don't know what it's actually called that's the aerial I really want. And then they have an evil queen because they have villains as well. This is what we're here for, essentially. I was just gonna get one, but now I think I need to get one of these two. And then these are very cute. I don't mind not getting these, but do I have self-control? You guys know I don't. We'll see what I end up leaving with. Hello friends! So it is a couple of days later now and we have a fun filled day. Well, in my opinion, a fun filled day. So I did just finish doing my makeup because I'm going to film a video but I just wanted to do a little vlog update first. I'm gonna go to McDonald's and grab some lunch because I have been up since like 8.30 in the morning and I've had nothing but water and a cup of coffee. I just finished doing my makeup. I just need to put some lipstick on and and I have this cute little pouch. It's a Marie pouch from the brand Skinny Dip London. They do a lot of Disney collabs and all their Marie stuff has been very cute. But I actually found this at TJ Maxx or Marshalls and I was so unbelievably excited as if I needed more pouches and bags. But I've been putting like 
lipsticks and stuff in here because I have a lip product problem. I've had this pouch kind of like stored underneath my dresses here on the clothing rack, so I kind of forgot what colors I have in here. These are also like products that I've bought semi recently that I put in here because I, I thought I wanted to film a TikTok haul, but I ended up not doing that. I think today I'm gonna go with the Too Faced Too Femi lipstick in the shade Never Grow Up. You have to see this lipstick, you guys. I'm not a big Too Faced person anymore. Their quality and their like their eyeshadow palettes and such has gone down tremendously but their lip products still are really good and i really like these they are hardcore lipsticks but look at the packaging so it's in this pink and gold tube it's a heart you guys i loved heart shaped things and then it has the little Too faced logo there and then like on the center there it has the little heart so good i'm gonna use the viewfinder as a mirror so if i'm looking up that's why also they smell really yummy i can't like figure out what it is that they smell like but they smell really good so i'm gonna get some lunch i think i'm gonna treat myself to some starbucks also i got my nails done i don't know if i showed you guys this in the beginning of the vlog i had mint nails i went to the nail salon and i've got this really pretty purple color but yes let's go get some lunch you guys i still haven't left my house like it's about to be it's three o'clock on the dot and i still haven't eaten anything because i'm the worst but i was doom scrolling on tiktok as one does you know when you're saying you're gonna do one thing and then you just end up on tiktok for hours that just happens and i saw someone say that their local ulta had the colourpop star wars collection in store so naturally before i even finished the video i opened my laptop and went on the ulta website to see what was available and by the website it looks like it's only the jelly much shadows i believe they released with this collection i can't remember but something in the little pot so i'm gonna assume it's that or it's glitter and the lipsticks and and the lip glosses so the eyeshadow palette is not available online the eyeshadow palette is not a very marcy color scheme but i do really really love the colors in it and i want it but i don't know why i do however really want the lip glosses because there's like a peachy glittery one and then there's like a purple glittery one now that is very marcy and they are available online and i checked for like buy online pick up in store and my local ulta allegedly has the collection in stock well it has the lip products if everything that's online is available at my store they might potentially have the eyeshadow palette as well i think the eyeshadow palette just sold out on the website so it's already not searchable on there but maybe it's available in my store i literally just told myself earlier that i was not gonna buy any more makeup that i was okay i was good i needed to take a break from buying makeup and then tiktok got the best of me and now i'm debating if i should go to ulta this day has definitely taken an interesting turn i finally got food oh hey finished eating like forever ago just finished filming my stony clover sample sale haul so excited that i was productive enough to actually film it but now I have to clean because I kind of just threw everything out of the way after I showed it. I feel like it wasn't a super duper long video, but then again, I didn't buy a whole bunch of stuff. Osmond gets off of work at six o'clock. I have to clean up and then I think it's already like almost five. So I think I'm gonna head into Manhattan to go to Ulta. I know I shouldn't, but we're gonna. We're gonna go to Ulta and then I don't know I wasn't gonna take any pictures like outfit pictures today But I kind of really like my outfit today I have these little bluebird from Cinderella earrings on my feels good to be home shirt and then my tulle skirt So I don't know. It's a very simple fit, but it's very cute. So maybe I'll see if I can like finesse some content in there Who knows? We'll see. We made it 30 minutes before they close I have an Osmond now. <laughs> Let's see what they got. Not what we're here for, but cute. I see it, I see it, I see it.
so no eyeshadow palettes. Just find out. <laughs> yeah, look at it. But they have the lip glosses. The real reason we're here. Definitely your shade. The goods have been acquired. I now own two more lip glosses that I definitely did not need. It is almost 11 o'clock at night. We've been back home for like hours now, but I did open my Miniso mystery boxes that you saw that I bought the other day. I posted it on my Instagram story. So you guys know the beginning of this vlog, we opened one, oops, spoilers, and we got Jasmine. So I bought another one of the princess pajama parties and I got Snow White this time. She's very, very cute. My camera will not focus on her. I'll flip you guys over so you can see her. And then the one that was like 100% brand new was the princess jewelry box. They look like they're on little macarons. And I opened it and I got Jasmine. <laughs> So the universe really wants me to have a Jasmine moment right now. And I mean, I'm okay with that because she is so cute, but I definitely need to go back and buy another box maybe next week. I'm gonna flip you guys over so you can get a better view of what they look like. The gang's all here. This little, like the smoke coming out of the lamp is actually detachable. It came inside the little box part. I would love to collect all of these and then put them maybe somewhere on this shelf all lined up. I think they would look so cute. And then these pajama ones, like I really, really want Ariel, Aurora, and Cinderella. Now I have two and I'm afraid to get another box because I'm afraid of getting a repeat. This is my little Miniso collection so far. It is a few days later now and I have a very exciting unboxing that I want to do with you guys. I actually picked this package up about two days ago and have not opened it. It's been sitting in a corner in my room and I knew when I picked it up that I wanted to film opening it with you guys for the vlog but i've just been getting out of work so late these past couple of days so today's the day we're here let's grab this massive box this is a package that was sent over to me by box lunch i'm a part of the box lunch collective which is like their influencer program that they have and they do different campaigns and i was selected for one and i was able to pick a few things from the website i want to show you guys what i picked out by the time this vlog goes up those pictures and reel and such are all probably going to be posted already so follow me on instagram to see what i end up doing i actually have an idea for a shoot that i want to do for some of these items which will probably be done later this week there are a lot of things to choose from but you guys know i am a bag junkie i love me some purses and backpacks and lounge fly and i am a multi-fandom kind of gal i love all things disney i love all things sanrio and i love all things anime magical girl animes to be specific so i got this Sailor Moon. I don't think it's a lounge fly actually, but it's this crossbody bag. I have been wanting this bag for months. I remember the first time they released these bags on the Box Lunch website. They sold out so quickly and people were reselling them for ridiculous amounts on Mercari. I remember, I think for my birthday, asking Osmond if I should get the crossbody bag or the backpack because there's a backpack similar to this. And he told me the crossbody bag and I didn't order it for some reason. Everything happens for a reason. I got it sent to me. So we got the crossbody bag. And then I also got the backpack. Because why pick one when you have the option of picking both? And then this bag, I got it sent to me. This is the Little Twin Stars Sanrio Loungefly backpack. The colors in this are so beautiful. I love all things Sanrio, but Little Twin Stars are my favorite. I know that's hard to believe because you see my TikToks and everything, and I am very Karomi and my melody, but Little Twin Stars are my like OG favorite aside from Hello Kitty. And then with the backpack, they actually released a matching card holder. 
Let's take everything out of the plastic, shall we? So this is the Sailor Moon backpack. It has pockets on the side. The handle is her wand, one of the wands. I actually have this wand on my wall. This is a box lunch exclusive and it's so cute. It's so simplistic. Oh my God. The back has Artemis and Luna. Then we have the crossbody bag with a different wand as the clasp here. You have to take the wand out to open it. <gasps> I'm obsessed with that. And then it kind of like dangles there and you open it. Are you kidding me? That is so stinking cute. Here's a better look at the little twin star Sanrio lounge fly bag. I know it was hard to see in all of the plastic before, but it's like this cream color with pink detailing. The hardware is gold. And then the front is a lavender shade with Kiki and Lala and constellations because they're little twin stars so it has constellations and then the card holder is just this cute so it's that pretty lavender color actually matches my nails and it has kiki and lala with all the constellations here and then in the back it has them really big thank you to box lunch for letting me pick out all of these new bags that i now need to find space for and i think i think we need to do an updated bag collection very very soon all right friends i'm going to end the vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me this week if you did give it a big old thumbs up be sure to follow me on my tiktok and instagram i am just at amor marcy pretty much everywhere on the internet and if you haven't already be sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you can be notified whenever i upload a new video as you saw in this vlog i think i filmed like two videos within this one vlog so lots of content coming very soon lots to look forward to i hope you have a magical day or night when you're watching this and i will see you real soon Mwah. bye